guys, I'm low-key lost in the forest, and the only thing that's giving me hope right now, if you guys are watching this, um, that means I made it out, and if you're a cop watching this after you found my body and my vehicle dead, um, well, you know what happened, so, okay, I think I remember that, I hope I'm kidding, everything looks the same. I went exploring and then got turned around. Uh oh. It forks off and I don't know which way to go. I'll be back. So, how did I get here? I don't know. Let's backtrack and figure it out. Good morning, you guys. I decided I would start, um, I guess, like documenting my trips um, as soon as we started going into like Oregon and Washington. But y'all, last night was freaking wild. So we um, went to the absolute most beautiful beach. I will insert pictures here, here. Um, and it's beautiful, and the dogs played on the beach, and it was awesome. And we're getting ready to go to sleep, but. Atticus decides to start alerting to the driver's side and I'm like what is going on and he's just alerting and for whatever reason he's like alerting but he's still sitting down which is somehow more terrifying than him alerting when he's like standing up staring like he's about to kill something because it was like what is going on and so the girls are sleeping everything is fine with them and I'm like oh my gosh and I start praying and I'm like god I need you to give me a sign like I don't know if it's just because I gave him him his anxiety medication um, this morning and he's just going a little bit crazy or if there's really something out there like I don't know and so I'm like okay I'm gonna give it some time after I prayed and he keeps alerting and I'm like we're getting out of here so we are um, getting on the road and it's this most beautiful drive-in um, because it was daytime let me tell you what guys that drive is not nearly as beautiful when it's freaking pitch black outside and there's tree coverage and there's still fog and you can barely see in front of you. Oh, I put on worship music and I was praising the Lord and I was just like, oh my God, be with me. Oh my God, be with me. But with my eyes open because that would be really scary. Um, and I was just literally like praising the Lord. Like I was like, I don't want to die today. I don't want to die. And I have no reception. That's what makes it even scarier is I have absolutely no reception. So I don't know how long I've been on this road. But it literally takes like an hour to drive those 20 miles because it's just so winding. And, and we finally get to town. And it's just, it's honestly like such a beautiful little town. Like I seriously, I want to go back when I have someone else with me. There's no place to stay in this little town. So we go to the next town over. And I'm like, let's just find a hotel parking lot so I can go to sleep in the hotel parking lot, right? Um, we find a hotel, a Holiday Inn. And I'm like, this is going to be great. Um, find a parking spot. I'm like, ooh, parking spot. Perfect. Look. And there's like five guys just sitting outside smoking and joking, talking right in front of the parking spot. And I'm like, that would be so awkward if I literally just like park in front of that parking spot and never get out of my car. Um, so I don't do that. But, well, we found another hotel parking lot and we settle in and all of this stuff. And Freya starts breathing really, really heavy and like freaking out. And I'm like, what is going on? So I'm like, okay, maybe she needs water because like the salt water in the ocean. So I pour her water. She doesn't want it. Um, and Atticus decides he wants to drink it. So he's drinking it and, um, Freya all of a sudden just stops breathing heavy and I look over and she had peed all over their blankets and I was like, oh, you were trying to tell me that you needed to pee. I'm sorry, baby. I didn't know. I felt like such a bad mom because I had no clue. And we'll just go to the laundry mat in the morning and wash everything before we head into Oregon. So yeah, we were about to go to the laundry mat and get that taken care of and I'm super pumped. But yeah, I just had to like let you guys know, like, oh man, it was such an eventful, freaking night. Anyway, we totally just found this place. Um, we're in some forest in Oregon. Finally, we're in Oregon, I'm so excited. And we are just hiking. Kix is right here. I didn't realize how much energy Freya has until we started hiking in the forest and she's just like all over the place. Yeah, so she literally will run like 50 feet ahead of me and Atticus will go with her and then Atticus circles back to make sure I'm doing good. It's really sweet. Oh, following trails and an Oregon forest. I'll put on the screen which forest it is because right now I don't remember. But honestly, like this is so much fun. Oh, where am I at? I don't know. All right, 
for better or worse, let's find out. Why do you? I have absolutely no idea how to get out of here. I'm kind of lost. And we're about to come up on like the most terrifying thing. That's a straight drop off. And this is like really um, hilly. So that's terrifying. Ah, ah, oh my gosh. Oh dear. You guys, that was one like single-handedly the most terrifying thing I think I've ever done. I almost just crapped out of my freaking stomach. As soon as I like put you guys down and I actually started driving, my car got stuck and then I just slightly reversed it and then tried to like go over those hills. I don't know if you guys could actually see them. And it was so scary because like the hill was like on this side, which means like my car is wanting to do this. And it's so like, I could see the cliff on this side. Now I gotta figure out where we are. But in a forest where I have no clue. <laughs> I have no reception and I just went exploring thinking I could track my way back and I think I took a wrong turn on the way back. Okay, good news. I am pretty certain I'm on the trail out of this forest. This is all looking very familiar. I just need to keep reminding myself that God's got me. Wherever I am is where I'm supposed to be. I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I'm actually really nervous. When I start traveling down the hill, it's a great sign, right? Right? I think so. Oh gosh, I remember that, you guys. I am on the right freaking path. Praise Jesus. Just saw a mound of rocks that I remember from when we first were going up here. I'm going the right way. Oh. So we might be lost in the forest, somewhere in Oregon, don't remember which one. Um, so I just wanted to say that I love you guys and I will let you know when I get out, if I get out, God willing. Okay, love you, bye. We made it, this is the main road. I'm so happy right now, oh my gosh. Do you guys just ever get like excited for like seeing God's creation? You're just like, this is beautiful. <laughs> like, this is real life. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. <sighs> so we're sleeping tonight. Mm. I gotta go find the dogs. I'll be back. <laughs> what do you think, Atticus? We are staying literally like, oh my gosh. This is where we're staying today. Oh, that's so peaceful. That's beautiful. You guys, this is gorgeous. That water, I don't know if you guys can tell, is super clear. Oh my gosh. teacup but it's what I've been using. <laughs> if you're curious, it's this tea right here. We should you guys do a little camp spot. Low key don't actually know if we're gonna be staying here because um it's really hot and it's like 57 but we had the windows rolled up kind of higher than normal because there's like seven million mosquitoes. Um so yeah, actually, you know what? I think we're about to move. And it's about to get dark out, so I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, you guys, we have settled in for the night. Got my tea. We literally just moved like right up the hill. And all of a sudden it just got really dark. So that's great. So I'm going to start editing this video. What's up guys, editing Micah here. So clearly I'm super great with outros. So that is what I'm doing now. I love you guys all so much and I'll see you in my next video. I would love it real quick if you would leave a comment down below what you would like to see on this adventure of mine and I'll make sure to film it. And also I would really, really love it if you go ahead and give this video a like if you liked it, liked watching me get lost in the forest. And also I'd love it if you subscribe because I literally have like three friends in life. So um, I need subscribers. Okay, guys, see you in my next video. Love ya.